Bingo. Now it's half start. How much is nine plus four? Ah! Bingo, bingo, bingo. Hello, kids. How are you doing today? I hope you're having a wonderful day. Today, I am working on my math homework. Here it is. I have to fill up this whole paper and solve these math problems here. That is my homework. Do you like numbers? Math is a very helpful tool to solve many problems. In the last episode, we learned that words are all around us. But guess what? Math is actually all around us as well. We use it for cooking. We use it for shopping when we count our money. We use it for traveling, to measure distance and time. We use it in our house decorating and our home projects. So math is very important. And math can be fun too, especially if you have friends who like it too. Talking about friends, I wonder if Dida and Sophie would like to help me. I do hear them outside, not sure what they're doing, but I am going to ask them if they like math and if they would like to help me finish my homework. I'm telling you, I want to have hopstock. No bingo. Hopstock. Bingo. No, it's hopstock. Hopstock. Bingo. Hi, girls. Hi, Tico. What are you doing? Anything fun? Actually, Tico, we have a problem. And, and the problem is a problem. A problem? Like a math problem? I'm here to help. Tell me what the problem is. No, Tito, this is not math. We have a real problem. Dita wants to play bingo, and I want to play hopstotch. We cannot do it. Can you help us, Tito? Tell Dita to play hopstotch with me. No, tell Sophie to play bingo with me. Tico, what do you want to play? Actually, I don't want to play. I want to do math. I came to ask you to help me do my homework. Um, we all want different things. Yes. What can we do? Oh, I know. I have a brilliant idea. What if we come up with a math, hopscotch, and a bingo game? Oh, yay! That way, we can all play together and do math at the same time. Yeah, but how would that work, Tico? Give me a minute. I'll show you. What I've come up with, girls. Now we can all be happy. I've combined my math homework with Dida's bingo with Sophie's hopscotch, and I've called it the math hopscotch bingo game. So the hopscotch is going to be the problem, and the bingo is going to be the solution. And by the end, my math homework will be finished. Isn't that a great idea? Yes, yes it is. This is super, super great idea. Yes. Let's play! So here's how we play it, girls. We start off with the hopscotch game. We throw the chip, and wherever it lands, we have to do that math problem. Then, you have to look for the result of the math problem on your bingo sheet. If it's there, then you can put a chip on it. And that's how we start solving the bingo. I will be red, Dina will be yellow, and Sophie will be blue. And blue. Good job, Sophie. Three plus four. Eight. How much is nine plus four? Nine plus four is thirteen. Okay, let's look at your paper. You are blue. Let's see. Thirteen. Sophie, you have thirteen. Good job. Okay, Dida, it's your turn. Ah. Hmm, that looks like two plus three. I think so. I think I know the answer. Two plus three is five. Good job. Now look in your five. yellow ones and see if you have a five. I have a five 
And I have a five too. Yeah. I'll put a five on mine. I'm drop this. Oh look, Sophie, you already have two of them. Okay, it's my turn now. It seems like four plus four. Yes, it is. Let me go hop and get it. And four plus four is eight. Eight. That's not even have it. Okay, let's go and see if we have it. Good job, Dida. Put your chip on number eight. Do you have a number eight, Sophie? Yes, I do. Pico, don't you have a number eight? Oh, I do not have a number eight. Your turn again, Sophie. Good job. Let's see what it is. Ten plus five. Let's think together. Ten plus five is... Fifteen. Okay, let's go see who has fifteen. Fifteen, fifteen. Um, I don't have fifteen. Do I have fifteen? Mm, no. It does not look like you have fifteen, Sophie. The only one that's left that didn't check the paper. Who is it? I think it's me, and I do have it! Yay! I'm going to try to go, go put this in a one plus one. Hmm? You did it! Yay! One plus one equals two. That's right! Alright, let's go see who has number two. I do is like the first one. Perfect. Good job. I don't think I have it. I don't have it either. Now I have three. Let me see what math problem I need to make a ten. Oh, it's right there. It's a five plus five. I'm gonna try that. Here I go. Oh no, it's actually four, four plus five. Okay, four plus five is actually nine. So let's go look and see who's got the number nine. I have it. I Two plus three does four. I do have four. I have a wall. Bingo, bingo, bingo. It looks like Dida has bingo. Oh yay! I got the bingo. Good job, Dida. You won this one. Yeah. And this is going to help my math homework. kids wasn't that fun did you see how we solved our problem by combining my math homework and their games every problem has a solution remember that now I'm going to tell you a fun fact about numbers did you know that every odd number has the letter E in it that's right try it and write it down and see how far you can go Look at these numbers here. Do you want to try some of these numbers in Spanish? Let's do it. One is uno, three is tres, five is cinco. Uno, tres, cinco. I hope you had fun today with numbers just as we did. Remember, you can play the same game just as we did. Just ask your mom and dad to print it out for you. I hope to see you for our next episode. Bye. Please support our new channel by subscribing and liking our videos. Thanks for watching!